Two Swedish nationals were shot dead and a third person was wounded in central Brussels on Monday night. A man who identified himself as a member of the Islamic State claimed responsibility in a video posted online. The men fled the scene after the shooting as a football match between Belgium and Sweden was about to start, triggering a massive manhunt and prompting Belgium to raise its terror alert to the highest level. A Belgian federal prosecutor said there was no evidence the attacker was still on the loose at any link to the Israel-Hamas conflict. Belgian Prime Minister Alexander de Croo said on social media that he has offered his condolences to the Swedish Prime Minister. Residents in Brussels have been urged to stay indoors until the threat is over.